Um, good afternoon. I don't know if you have any questions, but I'll just make a, a quick statement. Um, we had a very nice uh, discussion with the governor um, on the uh, benefits of Block E and expressed our willingness to work with him and the state lawmakers on um, if, if we can be helpful, we would like to be. So uh, we think that Block E has a wonderful generator of jobs as well as really brings new vitality to downtown Minneapolis. So we're excited about it. How much money would the Block E contribute to a Viking Stadium? Uh, that's totally up to the lawmakers. Uh, How what much would it generate? The, under the current uh, legislation that we've uh, proposed, it's approximately $100 million a year to, to the state. And a portion of that would, uh, your proposal would be to use a portion of that for a Viking state? It, again, that would be up to the lawmakers to uh, do with, with the funds what they would like to do with the funds. Well, then why are you here? To discuss with them, uh, really giving the governor a briefing on the project on, uh, so that he is aware of what's going on. So it has nothing to do with the right in the state yet? That's, again, uh, that's up to the governor and, and to the lawmakers what they want to do. Are you in any way connected with a development of a downtown Minneapolis stadium? And if you are, will the casino be connected in any way to No, uh, we are not uh, involved with the downtown uh, stadium proposal. So you wouldn't mind if the revenue was used for a stadium in either Arden Hills or Minneapolis or wherever they decide to do it? Again, it's really up to the lawmakers to do with it what they what they would like to. Just, just so were you invited, you invited, were you invited here or did you offer a uh, We were invited. Did you, did you discuss the, the, the governor's stadium, office? Sir? Say again? Did you discuss a Viking stadium at all? No, we did not. If, if, if your uh, project were approved with green light, how soon before the money would become available to the state? Uh, the uh, privilege fee would actually get paid in approximately six months, um, and the actual operation of the facility would be approximately one year. Thank you all. Wait, wait, one more question, one more question, sir. When you talk about the, the votes, do you think there's a support in the legislature for a casino in downtown Minneapolis, especially considering how strongly uh, Indian gaming is against this? Um, it's a, that's a very good question. The uh, downtown um, casino in, on Block E has a very minimal effect on the existing tribal facilities that are in the state. Um, so there's there's really a minor amount of impact that it would have on other, their operations. Thank you. Your bottom box, right? Correct. Thank you, Bob.